Hey guys, uh, welcome to your love reading for Libra. This is going to be for the first half of your November from the 1st to the 15th. You can apply this to your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus sign. So we're going to take a look and see what's going on with you guys in love and the person that you are connecting with. And then we will take a look at your person to see what their true feelings and intentions are towards you. And then we'll finish off the read with the possible outcome and advice and what else you guys need to know. Apply this to your own unique situation. Switch the roles if you want. Keep in mind that these are general messages. Uh, take what resonates and leave the rest behind. Um, if this message didn't resonate with you, take a look at your other placements if you guys haven't done so yet hit the subscription button and the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post. Give this video a thumbs up, uh, like this video, share this video, leave a comment down in the comment section below if this message resonates. Keep in mind that these are collective messages for the collective Libra people, not tapping into one specific person's energies in particular. If we're looking for a reading tailored to your specific unique situations and your energies, I suggest you book a private personal reading with me. The link for that is in the description box below. All right, Libra, let's get started. Tell me about Libra here. Tell me about Libra in love. Over energies regarding love and the person that Libra is connecting with for the first half of their November from the 1st to the 15th. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for Libra. All right, let's see what we have for you guys. Tell me about Libra and love. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs. Three of Swords and the King of Cups. Someone's feelings here are really, really, really hurt. The Tower, Aries, Scorpio energy. You know, one of the things is it's because one of the reasons why that someone here is completely hurt is because someone here abruptly, without notice, just left. Yeah. Someone here could have left you. You could have lost somebody here. King of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces could be dealing with any of those energies. Uh, the Tower, Aries, Scorpio here could be dealing with any of those energies. You might have those energies in your chart. Okay. I feel like by this person leaving, I feel like this was a blessing. Okay. Uh, because, um, Libra, I feel like this person basically was not ready for a relationship. I feel like this person was not mature enough to handle a relationship here. And I just feel like this person just left. Yeah, this person just left. I feel like they just came in to get what they wanted and probably got bored and left. Okay, Page of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sag, Queen of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. Tell me about the Three of Swords here. King of Swords, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini, the King of Cups here, and the Page of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. So what's happening is that I feel like this is you, the King here, and I feel like you reached out to this person, but this person has not responded to you because this person's not paying any attention to you. Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, the Tower, the Knight of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, the Six of Swords, and the Five of Swords here. You know, I feel like this person came out of nowhere, swept you off your feet, and then out of nowhere, they just left. So to you right now, this is quite the mind bender here, Libra. King of, uh, Knight of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, the Page of Wands, uh, the Star card here, Aquarius Energy, the Queen of Pentacles here, and the Three of Pentacles. Uh, you know, I feel like this person could be just kind of fixated on third parties, looking for other people here, okay? It seems like this person was definitely dealing with other people and I feel like that could have been revealed to you or that it's being revealed to you right now, all right? Uh, tell me about the person that uh, Libra is dealing with here. What is this person's true feelings and intentions towards Libra? for uh, the first half of their November from the 1st to the 15th, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for Libra. All right, we have the Two of Wands here and the Ten of Swords. We have the Six of Cups, the Seven of Swords, and the Empress here and the Five of Cups. So Two of Wands and the Ten of Swords. Seems like this person has a couple of options here. Okay. Um, you know, one of the things I'm getting here is that this person has con consistently betrayed you over and over and over again. 
it could be a situation that this person lied to you about an ex here. You know, I feel like maybe this person might have told you, oh, this person does, you know, they don't talk to their ex anymore. And perhaps they were sneaking uh, around behind your back, speaking with an ex. This could be indication that this person wants to sneak back into your life here. We have the Empress here in the Five of Cups. So this is interesting. You know, I feel like you could have been with an empress here. I feel like there was an empress in the picture here, but I feel like you could have made a wrong decision here and chosen someone else. Yeah. And I feel I feel like you got burned by this decision here. Um, Libra. Two of Wands, the um High Priestess, Ace of Wands and the Ten of Swords. You know, I feel like there was the energy of someone here knew sh that they should have trusted their instincts here. But I feel like we have someone here that's looking for a new beginning, and I feel like it could be this Queen of Pentacles here. Six of Cups, Temperance, Seven of Swords here, and the Eight of Pentacles. You know, I feel like someone here knows that, you know, you're a safe person to be around here. Um, the thing is, I feel like this person tends to create these like big web of lies and I feel like a lot of the stuff that this person says or does does not make any sense to you uh Libra okay the Empress the Knight of Wands the Five of Cups this is someone else this is someone else that you left behind to be with this other person and I feel like this person's leaving you behind so like I said I feel like you could have made the wrong decision here. And I feel like the, this wrong decision is biting you in the ass. Or you could switch the roles and maybe the other person made a wrong decision. Yeah. Um, outcome and advice here for Libra regarding their love situation. What else does Libra need to know? Look out for, for the first half of their November from the 1st to the 15th. Sun, moon, rising, Venus signs for Libra. We have the Knight of Pentacles in the Five of Wands. We have Judgment in the Nine of Cups. And then we have the Ace of Cups here in the Seven of Pentacles. Knight of Pentacles here and the Five of Wands. Mm. Judgment in the Nine of Cups here. It seems like someone here is definitely looking for some sort of reconciliation here. Okay. But, um, you know, Libra, this could be you more so wanting to invest in new love here instead of going back to the past. Or that it could be indication that this person is truly in love with you, or both people are. Let's see. Yeah, I feel like someone here, I feel like you, someone here let somebody down by choosing someone else here, okay? And this decision, like I said, bit someone in the, in, in the ass. The uh, Knight of Pentacles, we have the Eight of Wands, the Five of Wands here, and the Devil. Seems like someone here is coming back to fight. Or someone here is coming back to argue. Someone here could be really angry. Angry about a decision that they made. Judgment. Chariot. Nine of Cups and the Queen of Wands here. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energy. I mean, there could be new love that's coming towards you here. Okay? And they feel like this is like divinely guided. I mean, whoever this is, this is an individual that has their shit together or something like that. You know, I feel like the universe has provided you with a lot of opportunities, but when it comes to love, someone here keeps making the wrong decisions here. Ace of Cups, with the Hierophant, Taurus Energy, the Seven of Pentacles here, and the Ace of Pentacles. So Libra, there could be new love here. I mean, you could get a clean slate. That's if you heal from this and move on. Yeah, so I don't know if you made the wrong decision or someone here else here made the wrong decision or that you were one of the options here, you know? But like I said, it's biting someone in the ass, okay? So uh, Libra, I hope that this was helpful. I hope that this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Share this video, like this video if you haven't done so yet. Subscribe, hit the notification bell. I'll speak to you guys in the next one. Thanks guys, bye.